This is Cars and All the Time, and I'm getting your host, and we're here with Ben with another vehicle, and this one is? Uh, it's a Hummer H2 this time. And it looks like it's pink. It is very pink. Uh, I'm a plastic surgeon. We do a lot of breast cancer reconstruction, and uh, a few years ago we had an event uh, to raise breast cancer awareness, and so... What better awareness can you have than a pink Hummer? I, I, I believe it all the way. Oh, those huge wheels. <laughs> what size are those? These are 28s. Do they make them any bigger? They do. Uh, they, I have actually seen an H2 that has 32-inch wheels on them. Oh, my God. Do, do you have to have a ladder to get in? No, it's not too bad. It's uh, it's it, Believe it or not, even with these big tires and wheels, it has a leveling kit on the front, but there's no suspension lift on the rear. So the, the height of the vehicle is basically the same as stock. Uh, I believe it. Uh, it's, uh, so this this engine is completely different from the H1. It is. The H2 uh, was designed originally always to be a vehicle used uh, for public use. This has never had any military use. Yeah. Uh, a lot of the, the, the cosmetic features make it look similar to an H1 with the small windows, the vertical windshield, and things of that nature. But for all practical purposes, this has the drive line of a three-quarter ton Suburban. So it's a gas engine, six-liter Vortec, automatic transmission, right. basically lifted directly out of, a, out of the standard run-of-the-mill right. half and three-quarter ton Chevy trucks. And it is gas. Gets about 10 miles to gallon. Okay, that's about right. <laughs> Onward to the next vehicle.